Another day in the garage. We'll start off by feeding this one because she's hungry. And then we'll get back to it. So this morning, today, I am going to start mounting headlights. Mm -hmm. Alright, I think my Amazon head struts finally gave up. I'm going to start mounting headlights, make a mount for the fenders, mount for the intercooler, and then I'll work on bash bar. And then I'll get it all painted up and hopefully be done with this part and start working on other things. Well, that wasn't too bad. Um, it did take some time to get all these tabs fitted right and headlights where I wanted them. And then the dang hood mounts took longer than the headlights though. But got everything fitted. Headlights come off. If I were to pull this top bar off, all I would have to do is unbolt the intercooler, unbolt this, and then this whole top piece will come off with the headlights. Um, hood mounts are in place to the main structure, so is the fender, the fenders, so hopefully that helps for anybody who's wanting to do a tube front. It's not difficult, it just takes some time to do it, just take your time and do it right. Um, so now I'm going to get started on the bash bar. Back in the garage again, as always. If you haven't noticed, this is pretty much where I spend most of my time. <laughs> um, so I am making some plates for this. I'm going to make a front bash bar that hopefully sits fairly well where the bumper will just sit on with about four, six screws or six, six bolts. So. The last one I made was pretty sturdy, but it was pretty ugly, not gonna lie. So I'm gonna hopefully make this one a whole lot nicer, a whole lot more sturdy. And then, uh, and then the fabrication should be done for now. Fingers crossed, at least. Oh, actually, no, I take that back. I've still gotta do some aluminum intercooler tubing uh, when that gets in. So first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take these plates and I'm going to Drill a hole for the back bracket hole so it sits in, but then I'm going to notch a hole on the front of this plate so it can lock in place. You want to Yes. Yeah. So, and then from there, I'll start building my supports that come out to the bash bar after I figure out a way to hold this front bumper up. 
So start by doing that. Well, it looks like my battery died at some point. Um, but anyways, so I think I said it in the video correctly that the notch goes towards the back, not the front. For some reason on this side, I started with the notch in the front, which is obviously wrong, but it's okay. I had to clearance it anyway to get past the tow hook. So ideally, when you pull your bash bar off, or I pull my bash bar off, unbolt this one, loosen this one, it picks up like this and comes out. So that's why the, why most people notch the backside. So anyways, time to take a few measurements from the bumper and let's see if I can not screw up three pieces of tube today. Surprisingly enough, first shot, I got the tubes to fit perfectly inside of the bumper. Um, so I made, I went ahead and made two already. Now I'm just trying to figure out how to get this thing to line up good <clears throat> and then start building off of the frame to support the first one using probably a 90, a little less of a 90 now. Um, notched out for the frame rail and then mount there so obviously I gotta drop the car down don't really have a whole bunch of ways to fit, hold it upright so I'm kind of being creative here but it's level it's perfectly spaced away from the car so all I have to do now is get down to I think I'm gonna put the tubes right about here under the headlight that way the bumper can sit on top and be right below the headlight. So we'll try that. I think I'm gonna call it a night after this. I'm just gonna finish welding up this thing. But I am very happy with the way it turned out. I got room for my intercooler cup lines. Kinda cool but funky looking design. Space there. It's all nice and even. KB bumper should just snug right up to that. Should be pretty solid. So, I hope you liked the video. Um, please hit that like button or give me a comment, tell me something that you like or you, or you don't like or if you have a question about it or I did something funny looking. Not a professional, I don't do this all the time. Um, so this was, as this thing is, it's just a fun project car just fabricating and building and having fun with it so but yeah if you like the video please hit the subscribe button and then i will see you on the next one